Two tone man, you feel me? Man, I'm powerful, bro. I can't even. Y'all already know what time it is. You feel me? We in the middle of the Nah, I'm from Bravo. A lot of them. For a lot of them. But hey, you vibe with Papa No Levy, though. Baby, that's what's up. That's what's up. That's what's up, bro. I, I, got a little, got a little video just draw, you know, a, a little old 2K new. Take flight on the YouTube. True Tone, T R U T O N Y. T O N Y. And I got a another coming out on that phone. We can soon, so y'all take tools. Take flight. But that's what we take flight. 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 I see that. Yeah, that's that. Black power. Black power. Black power. There you go. There you go. That's what's up. Working with Pro Fans, of course. Rico Pro Fans in the building. This video, I have the common courtesy <laughs> of sitting next to somebody. I'm not even gonna, you know, make it seem like that's who you trying to be. But when you first see this man right here, all you think about is stunt life. Side, <laughs> 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 no, the man looks just like it's amazing, man. How how you just do not know how much like when he walked in, cuz he had to show the bounce and everything. Like, I was just waiting for him to fit in the camera, nigga. Like, <laughs> 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 Shout out to the main man. <laughs> Hey people, Christy wants me to see him. I'm here with True Tony. True Tony, thank you so much for being here. True Tony, so what's up? What's going on with you? Not much, you know, just on the music tip, you know what I'm saying? Trying to keep them open. We right here with Rico Pro Fans and Christy, you know. Y'all, you know, keep your eyes open, you know what I'm saying? We out here, man. Right now, Brian County 95, so a lot of Dell, you know what I'm saying? 2K views on the tape flight. I Got some more stuff going. That. Most stuff coming soon, you know what I'm saying? You know, so y'all just stay tuned, you know what I'm saying? But like I say, Brian County, Brian County. Real though. So aside from your tape flight videos, what other projects do you have going on right now? Uh, you know, um, I got 6K on a um, little track called Black Power, you know, I ain't put the video out yet, but you know, Rico Profile is gonna shoot that though, so, you know, y'all stay tuned for that. <laughs> you know, that's coming soon. Um, I want everybody, matter of fact, I don't know when exactly the video shoot gonna be, but, you know, many family and friends and all, you know, I want y'all to be in it. You know, I'm gonna have as many teachers as I can have, you know, to try to promote and put it out there though, for the Black Power, though, you know what I'm saying? Y'all already know. So is that like a movement that you're trying to get going aside? Because Black Power has already been a thing, but are you trying to start a movement with that, encouraging more Black yeah, Power? Yeah, as okay. in the youth, you know what I'm saying? Because a lot of true. the youth right now ain't really like Very trying to true. like look towards it. So I'm trying to push it towards them, you know what I'm saying? Very true. So how do you feel about the music and the way that it's turned now? Do you feel like it's gone for the worse or do you think you see the silver lining in the cloud? Well, you know, in the way I... To be honest, I feel like it's going for the worst, but I still see the civil line in the cloud because, you know, like they always say, you gotta have hope, you know, you gotta have faith. So, you know, I have faith that some type of way, you know, the intellectual artists that's out here that's gonna, you know, eventually come up one day, you know, soon. Soon, soon. I believe that too, because that's, that's what I was actually talking about last week with another artist, that the way that music is interpreted is all on the viewer's kind of point of view, because any song could be misinterpreted as something else because of euphemisms and metaphors. How do you feel about the use of metaphors in music when an artist says, oh, I wrote this, but it's not really what I really what I preach? You know, it's not, not really, really what you mean. mean. Exactly. I mean, at the end of the day, it's like, you know, they could be trying to paint a picture, you know, to try to get a point across, but at the same time, you know, it takes away, I feel, sometimes from what we're trying to get across. And, and like, you know, the real part. The so, truth. You know what I'm saying? Which is the truth, yeah, exactly. So, that's that's how I look at it. That's why I really, I try to just, just come straight out with it blunt. You know, and just be obvious with them to put it all on the table. So when my viewers listen to your music, it's gonna be truth. Yeah. It's just his life story. No cursing. You know, that's that, that's, that's another positive. Another yeah, positive. You know, that's, that's your kids can listen to it. Yeah, you know, so it's like that way they can hear it. You know, exactly. I got kids. So. No, Is that a platform that you're trying to push? Yeah. For kids as well to listen to your music? Mm -hmm. I think that's very store. important too. Yes, to you know have it in store. Well, it makes it more. You know, massively better. appealing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, and aside from just the platform of having 
being relatable to the family household and being related to, relatable to lyricists, what else were you trying to push this music on that platform? Like what well, the platform? beat spread out like, you know, for my brothers from the hood, you know what I'm saying? Because I feel like at the end of the day, we don't have no guidance. And right now it's like, you know, a bunch of crowds in the buckets, you know, everybody trying to make it out and nobody not trying to help put other one up. They're all pulling each other down. Exactly. That's a so, good metaphor. That's really what's going on right now. But, you know, I look at it like we all just trying to like, you know, if somebody just come up and show like love and show enough love to where everybody else show love. You know what I'm saying? Basically, that's all good. So, you say that you're very real, which is one of the things that is kind of, I hate to say gimmick, because you know that's the word that's thrown around loosely, but if you say you're gimmick, which a lot of people compare you to Tupac, which I would say the same thing on record, I would say the same thing, because you sound, your sound, your look, a lot reminiscent to that. Are you in that era? Would you say that your rap music is more catered to that era of music? Yeah, like, well, basically on the conscious level, you know? It's Which is not available right now. I'm just letting you know. Aside I'm from J. Cole and Kendrick and a few other artists out there that are mainstream. Yeah. Just trying to basically get that point across. But from like an underground artist perspective. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So that's basically what I'm doing right now though, you know? But we need more conscious music. Yeah. So, and it's, it's coming though. Like I say, I like, time like time for change, till uh, T4C. Like I say, true Tony, you know, Brad County. 954, man. You know? You know, another CD coming soon after that. I, I, I was, was just thinking about to ask that. <laughs> if I should drop another one, you know, Road to Success. But, you know, I was like, you know, I don't know, you know, should I put that out there yet? Because the name Road to Success is like, so many people out there use that name, it's just cliche, you know, like, you know, so I was like, either I can use it, because it sounds like something that people might want to click on, like, oh, Road to Success. So that sounds like. He telling me how he's made it to his way to success. But then again, I thought about it like, you know, I haven't made it all the way to success yet, so that's why I didn't come out with that thing yet. But thinking about that type of title. Like I said, another CD coming soon, though. It's in the well, making. We're going to hashtag, because I recall it today on NHS Radio. We're going to hashtag two truths on <laughs> Because it fits them. Like, the verses that I've heard, which I really like, I like your aestheticism when it comes to lyricism. That's one of the things that I look for inside of an indie artist. When I say indie, I mean undiscovered. So, if you were to try to sign to somebody, who would you want to be your? I don't want to say mentor. Money, but mentor. I mean, <laughs> I mean, to be honest, right now, I would like. Would you work with like, let's say, I'm gonna throw some names out there. Let's say Missy Elliott. Yes or no? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I want to put myself on the spot uh, right now with Timberlake. artists. Timberlake. I want to. What's his name? Just Justin Timberlake. I want I would work I, listen I would work with whoever God put in my perspective if that's what it's meant to happen in the destiny to happen but at the same time I don't know who I would work with you know in the future so right now I know that you know I'm just gonna do what I'm doing now to eventually I get who I gotta get to you know what I'm saying I ain't trying to rush nothing I'm just being patient because like I said at the end of the day I already know it's gonna happen so when it happens it happens you know what I'm saying right now right now we're in what this is April 26th 2016. Uh, matter of fact, hold on. I think it's what time it is. Might be the 27th now. But like I said, it's the next day, you know. Y'all just stay tuned, man. You know, May right around the corner. The summer right around the corner. So, you know, all the summer babies, which I'm one of them. Y'all you know, stay tuned, you know what I'm saying? Okay, Black so tell people where we can find you at. Well, y'all find me on YouTube. You feel me? We go pro films right now. And y'all can find me also. Uh, Florida Till I Die, that's what the Black Power is on. Facebook, True Tony Bot Minds. Instagram, same thing, True Tony Bot Minds all together. No spaces. And then at the same time, you know, y'all just basically, like I say, stay tuned. Also, matter of fact, you know, we just did a little side little interview earlier, you know, at the NHS radio. The Great FM earlier, you know what I'm saying? Like I say, though, you know, we got more work coming through. A bigger interview, You feel me? <laughs> so, you know, just stay tuned, you know what I'm saying? Rock County, like I say, you feel me? Thank you again for your time. Yeah. And as always, it's a pleasure. Make sure you follow him, True Tony. About mine. No. On Instagram. True Tony. 
about mine. Make sure you follow him because this is untapped resources right here. And you will be very happy with your search results. So, Google my dog. I'm just saying. <laughs> this is Christy one for you to see from NHS Radio. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to our channel. Make sure you follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter because we do have that now. Our Snapchat will be up and running probably by the end of the weekend. And we have a bunch of new projects coming up on our YouTube channel that you do not want to miss. So thank you so much. Plug in YouTube.com slash Rico Pro Films because there's a lot more stuff on there from NHS Radio that we haven't posted yet. So you can get a Jump up on the track. Okay? Love you guys. Love Chris and Chicken Grease, NHS Radio, Uncut, Uncensored.